Hi everyone, today I'm here with Reborn Art Doll Honey. She's looking adorable in her little outfit with her little ice cream swaddle. It's actually not really an appropriate theme for today because it's actually pretty chilly. But we have her little jelly cat piggy here she's snuggling with. You all know, Honey is my current favorite in my collection. She's been getting a lot of attention and a screen time. So today's video is going to be about this bottle. This bottle has had this Reborn doll milk in it for three years. How did this happen? Well, <laughs> um, this bottle just kind of got lost. I didn't know where it went for a while, probably about a year. I haven't like seen this bottle in a year. Then we moved and you know, as you're moving, things get lost and things get found. So this was found and the fabric softener that I used as fake milk has gone solid in here. <laughs> yeah, and I'm wondering if this is salvageable, if this bottle is salvageable. So we're going to find out together today. I just thought that would be a fun little video to do. What happens to a reborn doll bottle with fake reborn milk in it for three years? And then if it is salvageable, I will put some new fabric softener in it recently picked this up at Walmart. A lot of you ask me what I use for fake reborn doll milk in my bottles when I'm not using expired formula that's not edible for real babies. I'm actually almost out of the can that I'm using right now for my videos. Um, like I said, expired, not edible for real babies. <laughs> Going back to fabric softener for most of my videos, at least for a while until I can get a new can of expired formula. But I picked this up and my last Walmart outing video, I picked the mildest scent I could find. This one, I think is just fresh scent, which makes sense because it just smells like fresh laundry. I went through and smelled all the different fabric softeners to find something that wasn't too flowery and just too strong of an odor. So that's what I'm using, for those of you who wanted to know. Let's get this bottle to the sink and wash it out and see if it's still usable. The bottle is definitely salvageable. I think that part of it was that this bottle was sealed shut really, really tight. It was really airtight, which I think is important when doing these types of bottles, especially if you want to keep them for a very long period of time, like a year to three years. Um, I've had some reborn bottles only make it a few months with fabric softener in them. Um, and then I've had some well, obviously this one made it like three years, even though the fabric softener needed to be replaced now. So let's do that. See, here's the silicone part. It's, it's fine. So let's go ahead and pour in this new fabric softener. And we will see how it looks, if it needs a little bit of water added to it. Um, I have also seen some people, hold on. Let me turn this so I can see. I want to put it at like maybe a little over four ounces or so. Probably. I've seen some people put vanilla extract in there as well to make more of like a yellow color. Let me look at that and see what I think. That's like exactly a little over four ounces. What do you all think? Does that look pretty realistic? Yeah. 
yeah I think it does actually even like the consistency of it does not look too bad the only thing that I see that's different is that it kind of sticks to the side of the bottle a little bit if that makes sense you can see that like but you can't you definitely can't tell unless you're really looking for it so let's see if honey wants to have a bottle <laughs> so here's the bottle being used as a prop I think it looks pretty realistic what do you think I'm thinking about going to Burlington or another store to soon and trying to pick up a few more bottles to seal because I don't have very much of a variety in bottle props for the dolls right now and I would really like to let me know in the comments if you want to see me do a video sharing how I seal the bottles I did one uh, probably about a year ago now but I would love to do another one especially showing where I get some really great bottles for the Reborns for great prices. I hope you all enjoyed this short little tutorial style video and thanks for watching.